Kentaro Kobayashi, the director of the Tokyo Olympics opening and closing ceremonies, was dismissed from his role on Thursday after an old clip of the comedian making jokes about the Holocaust emerged online, in what is a major blow to the event on the eve of the opening ceremony. Kobayashi's dismissal follows a series of other high-profile exits of controversial figures from the game's organizing team. Earlier this week, Japanese composer Keigo Oyamada stepped down from the opening ceremony after an old interview of him admitting to bullying his classmates with disabilities resurfaced. The organizers initially indicated that the Oyamada would remain a part of the ceremony after he had shown remorse for his actions. But hours later, the composer submitted his resignation and the organizers issued a fresh statement calling his actions absolutely unacceptable. On Thursday, Hashimoto expressed regret for the organizers taking too long to dismiss Oyamada. In March, Hiroshi Sasaki, the creative director of the opening ceremony, resigned from his position after reports emerged that he suggested Naomi Watanabe, a popular plus-sized female entertainer, could wear pig ears at the opening ceremony. Sasaki reportedly even referred to his pitch of Watanabe's character as Olympic. In February, the Games lost the original chief of its organizing committee after Yoshiro Mori was forced to resign from his position over sexist remarks. The former Japanese prime minister reportedly said women talk too much and have a strong sense of rivalry during a board meeting, sparking global backlash. Tokyo Olympic ceremony director fired over Holocaust jokes, Kyoto News, Kentaro Kobayashi, Olympics opening ceremony director, dismissed over Holocaust jokes, Daily Beast.